Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. It's time now for a fresh and delicious recipe to get us through the midweek hump. And our good friend, Chef Cam is here. And he's gonna show us how to put a spin on the traditional avocado toast. Good morning, Miss Kwai. So how are you doing, doing today? This. I am doing just fine. Yes. You know, avocado toast can be kind of boring. Yeah. A lot of times lot it of is times boring, it you know? Is, and it has no flavor sometimes. So that's why we're here, you know, as the flavor guys. The lack of flavor. To add it right on top of there. Yes, so God. let me show you a couple ways that you can increase the flavor. Because yes. there is some flavor Absolutely. in avocado toast. Oh my God, the first yes. thing we could do is actually by toasting the bread. Toasting you know, the bread. So get us, you, you know, some. Pan, you yeah, we have our hot pans. I have some already over here for us so we don't okay. have to reach for it already cut. Okay. And then we'll just put those in there. We have some that are already a little bit toasted. Good. So what a lot of people do is they don't toast it enough. Mm. So what you want to do is be able to render the flavor from the toasted bread. And I like the crunch of Yeah, it so too. that crunch, it adds that texture and there's yeah. flavor and texture as yeah. well. Yeah. So what we have over here are some also some things that are help increase flavor. So you so got I'm, some sriracha there? Got some sriracha, got some balsamic, got some avocado aioli, mm. but instead of using fresh vegetables, yeah. which are good for avocado toast, yeah. we pickle them. So oh. what I did was I chopped some red onion and some bell pepper and overnight I set them in some water, apple cider vinegar, yes. white vinegar, a yes. little white peppercorn and black peppercorn mm. just to increase the flavor as it, it cuts through the monosaturated fats mm. of the avocado. Yeah. It'll add that flavor and that balance between between the sweet and the fat of the avocado, mm. and then we have the the boing, the just the, the boisterous flavor of the onion, but it's yeah. pickled. The yeah. boisterous flavor of the pepper, yeah, there. and it, it'll balance it out for us. I see you have jalapeno peppers. That's I just have a little bit of extra sandwich? spice, just in case. You know, so today is the remix of the avocado Let's toast. Get it. So we want to be able to add some flavor. So I got a little spicy grilled shrimp and some smoked salmon that we can add to the top Why of one I if so we need hungry, it. Why am I so hungry like right now, baby? I, I can hear the stomach just a little bit. I know. It's talking don't to tell me, saying, the oh, "Don't tell them what the stomach is saying." What is it saying? Hey, Cam. Hey, <laughs> yeah. and so, it's right. <laughs> so, honey. so let's so, go ahead and get into the So, what we want to do is we have some some toasted baguette right here. Okay. And I have some avocado. It's so just, just fresh avocado take... right out of the shell and okay. mashed. Yep. So you're gonna take her just right there. Okay. And what we want to do is add a, a nice amount to it. You know, you want to okay. kind of don't be stingy. Don't then. be stingy with it because you're gonna layer it so high that you don't want to miss out on all the flavor of the avocado. That's good, right there. Okay. And we'll set her down right on our cutting on board. One. Just get a little bit right there. And what we want to do is make a couple. So okay. you know, once our sisters join us, then if they want it, it'll be ready. ready and just go. in case they want to have different flavors other than just the vegetable okay. toast, they can hold have a different one. I'll hold it flat for you, my love. Oh yeah, you can do it right on there. And what I'll do is I'll grab my little piece of spatch, spatch right here. Okay. And I'll help you go right in there. Mm -hmm. So the way that we build flavors is we think about the profiles. So we got the, the fattiness and the sweetness of the avocado. Uh -huh. And then that's where we'll take our pickle red onion right here. See how beautiful that color that it oh, renders? Yes, God, I we'll do. just add that right on top of that fresh avocado that's already there. That's okay, that's perfect, Miss Quad. You know you, you're good with the presentation. Mm -hmm. Now if you want to grab our bell peppers, you could grab a couple of those right here in front of us, I those sure pickle do. ones. Mm -hmm. And you could follow right after me. So what this is about is, yep, that's perfect. It's just getting a balance of flavors and color because we want to be able to eat with our eyes sometimes before we eat with our stomachs. Well, you know? I eat with my eyes all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I be so eating a right, lot of things. Right so. now we have a, a perfect balance. So of, beautiful. Uh, thank you. So what we want to go from there is, I'm just going to get these plates out because I know as soon as we get it ready, they're going to be ready to eat on some yes, of that God, right there. Will. So they're what hungry. we have right now is our balsamic drizzle. Mm -hmm. What the balsamic does is it adds that extra layer from the sweet. Yes. Now we have the we have the, the pickled onion and bell pepper, mm -hmm. and then this is a strawberry and fig balsamic. Ooh, so that what it, good, yeah, man. so now that one is so it's really not good. Just it's, yeah, so this is how we're gonna add flavor, yeah. guys. It's all about flavor. Yeah. When we're eating healthy, it's not a really we don't like want to. Yeah, sometimes balsamic. Way some, sometimes it's overpowering. You yeah. know, it's not really good for Mess our up your whole meal. Yeah, but this one right here, it just adds a good balance. So you want to get a good a even nice drizzle. drizzle on you don't that. want any of it to and stay too long. And you're not overdoing it. No, you're not overdoing it. And then right here is a house made avocado aioli. So now this is vegan so what we would use is a little avocado oil mm -hmm. we use some fresh avocado and then we add some basil some parsley mm -hmm. some salt and pepper and then we use an emulsion blender and we bring all of those flavors into one you're gonna put a little bit on I'm there. just gonna give it just a little bit of drizzle like that mm -hmm. I don't know if they could catch that from right so from right yonder this smokes salmon though <laughs> oh that is, is it hitting so, you right oh, there baby, you know we got some hitting. fresh crushed black pepper Love that we want to add right over the top you know, did you bring me cayenne today I didn't bring you cayenne but I right. got you some crushed red you okay, know just I'll so you can get a nice little flavor 
right, put that one right, on mine. Right in, in your bite. They mm -hmm. all need one just because we have to add that layer of spice. Okay. Because you want the acidity, you want the fatness, you want the sweetness, and you want the spice. And I want to taste it. You want to be able to taste it just so you can have a perfect bite. Yeah. So I know you've been eyeing over there on that smoked I'm salmon. I'm on that smoked salmon, so want, heavy, heavy. So what we do is we just take some fresh smoked salmon yeah. from the market, yeah. give it a nice little roll mm -hmm. so we can have a cute little yeah. presentation right there. Mm -hmm. And what we're going to do is, is stick that right on the top. Oh, and for pretty. you, what I'm going to do, it is. I'm just going to add just a little bit more red on there. And, uh, and I'm going to give a dab of that little piece of sriracha right these on the top. Ha so those peppers, jalapenos, what are we do with those? You, you, want, you want us to, to, yes, to chop you know, a little I, piece of... I need spice in my life. Let me grab my knife for you right Go quick, ahead, my love. So we'll get you a fresh cut. So what's perfect is is that now what people don't realize are all of the health benefits of the avocado oh, child yeah. well, and what we, they do for your skin. Can we talk about it when we return? When we return, yes. All right, so for now we're going to go to commercial and we will be right back. And he also has an amazing drink for us that's going to go very well with his avocado toast. You want to stick around, honey. So you guys will return. I, I just need a little bit more. Yes, God. Yes. <laughs> we are back. In a matter of fact, Cam, you're going to go ahead and take us through this drink. Okay, so right here mm. is what we have is a, I call it Key Lime Kiss Mimosa. Ooh. 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 You like the way that sound, lime. don't it? So what, okay. it ba what it basically is is a drink that complements the, the avocado. Uh, so anytime so. you have avocado or any type of fatty acid, mm. you want to have something with a higher level mm -hmm. of acidity, mm. like a white wine, like a Sauvignon Blanc, mm. or you could do a white sparkling wine, like a Prosecco, or or champagne, mm -hmm. but I added just a little bit more acid by doing a little key lime mixture. Yeah. So I take a little bit of lime liqueur, some sweetened condensed milk, and I chill it over ice, and then I hit it with you guys' favorite champagne. Oh, I tell and then you, you know you just you just you, thank you so much. You just you toast that it right there. And what it helps you do is make your your meal a little less guilty. So you know mm. it's what you really would call oh, a that skinny is mimosa. Delicious. Mm. Thank you. Mm. My goodness, mm. that's good. Right now, now. tell me what y'all think about that toast. It's so My good. Because I'm about to take a little piece. Just this bite is on so down good. But how about this you're shrimp? Always Thank amazing. You. you like that shrimp? <laughs> I'm gonna try to lead you out of here. Just enjoy your food. These but thank though. you so much for this lip smacking recipe. Mm. And for more of these delicious mm. recipes, definitely go to Instagram at Cooking with Cam. Mm -hmm. Perfect. I really like it. Yeah. <laughs>